Welcome back to Resident Evil 3, ladies and gentlemen. And we are just about to cross the bridge. No. Into the unknown. Actually, no, we're just about to get confronted by Nemesis. So, what do we do here? Pushing him off or we're jumping off? Well, you know what? I'm, I'm tired of running. We're going to push this bastard off. Take it easy, buddy. <laughs> Suck. Well, we've made it to the dead factory. Well, what can I say about this place other than yikes? Oh, I actually do like this place, but I'll talk more about it in a second. Right now, we have somebody to meet. Carlos. Jill, listen very carefully. They're planning on launching a missile directly into the city as soon as day breaks. The explosion will be powerful enough to destroy everything. Are you sure about that? Positive. I heard it straight from a supervisor. They'll go this far to cover their tracks? Come on, we have to hurry. There isn't much time left. I love Jill's response. Are you sure about that? You've heard everything yourself, lady. Hi. City in danger, Jill Valentine's taking time out to read somebody else's diary. Classy lady, isn't she? Manager's diary. What other kind of juicy secrets were there? Alright, well, we ha looks like we're going to have ourselves a ball with some inventory management. Shiny thing. I like shiny things. It's a key. Well, our inventory's full and we've got things to pick up. You know what that means. Time for a... Jump cuts are so jarring, aren't they? So very distracting. We have sorted out our inventory. Look at that. We know that out of the way. Let us carry on and boot up some steam. Yes, we're going to go and disrupt some valves. <laughs> I didn't mean Gabe Newell's steam, of course. I meant this. This annoying little steam puzzle. It's not terrible, but it's just... An obstacle designed to frustrate and annoy slightly. And that's that done. Woo! That takes a little while to do, I tell ya. Right. Beep. So some distinct door elsewhere has been unlocked for us. Cool. This. Oh, I forgot to put that away. I should do that then, shouldn't I, really? The reloading tool. Only useful for as long as you need it. With that, we shall continue on our merry way. <laughs> you aren't getting me today, Drendimos. Yep. 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 You know what? Boom! Boom! You're dead. Cool. Now what we've got to do now, let's just do this. Boop. Combine with that. Combine with that. And we get that. Cool, innit? And then we do this. 
do that with other herbs. Oh my god, I hate this part. Ooh, do, 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 combine. Do, 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 do. I go around there. Grab ourselves a master system. I mean a master disc. I mean a system disc. Right. And then we just kind of save it there for a second. And then we might just have to head on down somewhere else. Oops. Almost forgot to equip something for safe guarding. Yes. Oh man! Are we ready for the rock and roll? Cause I sure am not. I believe there were dead humans coming out. I think I believe it was like kind of zombies and shit going on there. What's going on here then? Oh, just worms. Really nothing to nothing, nothing uh, serious to worry about there then. I really would. That's, yay, missed me. And you're not gonna kiss me. Whoa. And here's something we can pick up and read. We gotta go around the chair though. Hello. What's that? Yeah. Security manual. On the job training. Maintenance of the device. Boop! We've taken the security manual. Cool. What's this? Oh, I can't carry more items. Of course I can't, because I got this crap all unloading on me. Well, you know what that means. I've got to get rid of some stuff. That down. Oh, shit. Sure. I, I, I had a whole set. There we go. All my lovely items up there. That goes in there. This key is about to come in useful for the reasons you wouldn't have even expected. Well, it might come in useful. It's probably a little bit too, um, well, early for that yet. But I am going to prepare it for a certain use. Wait, no, 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 we've got to grab the water sample. Water sample first, and then we prepare that key for its ultimate destiny. Water sample. Right. Um, this is kind of a very fun little area. Not really, because ultimately, nothing of interest actually happens. Ultraviolet rays are applied to the water. There's a tiny slot where a plastic card could fit. Alright, so we will just put the plastic card in the slot. Yes. And that's that. And yes, now we have basically this little thing to do. It is a water sample device. And now we get to play Match the Pattern. There's a device to check the water quality. Yes. And here's one of Resident Evil's most kind little puzzles. And by kind, I mean annoying as fuck. Um, we have to match the pattern on the top with the result. So, yep, so we have to try and emulate that somehow. And I'm going to check. Um, it's like, well, let's just do a quick check. Uh, check. <laughs> I couldn't be any further away if I tried. All right. God, this is frustration.
Oh. And there we go. Water quality check has passed the safety level. I rock. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and that unlocks that little area. And there it is. The lock seems to have been released. And you know what, guys? Right, since that took a long-ass time to do, I think that's about time I call it a day. But the next time around, it's a non-stop ride to the end. The finale is coming. Will you be there to join us? Resident Evil 3 concludes next episode. Robert Q TV, signing out.